athletes ages eight and older have been preparing to compete all year long, and the younger kids even got to join in on the fun today. Alexa Helwig tells us about the first ever Young Athletes Festival. It's a special weekend for the Special Olympics. The Kentucky Summer Games have kicked off and athletes from all over the bluegrass have taken over the campus of EKU. We've never been here. This is our first year, so excited to see what else there is. And it's also a first for the Young Athletes Festival. Kids ages two to seven train all year for many of the events, getting prepared for the real deal. When you turn eight, you get to go on the big track and you have the gun sound and you run without parents. So we get them used to doing all that fun stuff. The festival had six stations set up with events like bowling, basketball and running. So the Young Athletes Festival was based on um, activities that we saw at the USA Games in Seattle, Washington this past summer. Karen Parsley led the event today. She says it gives the younger athletes an inclusive experience and a taste of the summer games. <laughs> Parents and coaches say the festival was a success. Watching them excel is amazing. To first, our first practice usually we're running all over the place and not even in our lanes. And by the time we get here, we're running in the lanes and counting and waiting. And they're helping each other and cheering each other on. And that's what's amazing. As the first Young Athletes Festival finished this afternoon, organizers reflect on how rewarding their jobs can be. We get to see these athletes quite a bit. A lot of our athletes, um, as they age up into competition, they are multi-sport athletes. And we in Richmond, Alexa Helwig, LEX 18 News. Looks like a lot of fun, and they got some beautiful weather for those competitions.